This is my new home build. It is a conventional tail twin motor pusher capable of long range FPV, waypoint mission flying, and carrying up to four four cell lithium ion flight batteries, which makes up a total of 12,000 milliamp hours for long duration flights. The plane has a 1.6 meter wingspan arm and wing, which can be removed for transport, and the fuselage length is one meter. The front part of the fuselage is 5 inches tall and 2.5 inches wide and the back part of the uh, total fuselage is 2.5 inches tall and 2.5 inches wide which is a perfect square. The plane has long range control with the online R receiver and the flight controller for this plane is a Matek F411 WSE. So the motors on this aircraft are 5010 size 750 kV motors with 12 by 4.5 inch props. So this is a quite unusual aircraft and people were weirded out when they saw it for the first time. So the main reason why I've built it like that is because I got inspired by the Piaggio P166 airframe which has the similar setup of two twin mid-motor pushers. I don't know why they've built their plane like that but I think there is like some reason maybe uh, efficiency uh, behind it. So uh, I thought to build it like that as well and see like what happens. So I'm aware that there are a couple or a lot of downsides to this uh, setup for an FPV plane, but the main advantages for me are that I'm having a clear view whenever I'm using my panning servo up to 180 degrees to look over the wings. The view is clear. Um, it's also cool to have like the prop in the way, but for observing and just having a long range cruise, I just prefer my like view to be uh, completely clear and not obscured by any motors or anything else. So I'm flying this plane with a 4-cell, 4 4,000 milliamp hour LiPo battery for the time being and flight times have been about 18 to 25 minutes depending on my throttle input upon cruising. So if you want to know more about this plane, subscribe to the channel because I think I've shared enough information about this plane in this video. So thank you guys for watching and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more about this plane and a lot more content coming up your way and like the video to support the channel. Thanks for watching again and I'll see you next time.